so now we're gonna do a Google Pixel using the dirty cow method. So same thing, open up TalkBack, enable TalkBack, and then disable it. Enable it one more time. Text to speech settings, turn it back off. And we have the awesome little menu right here to the side. So what I'm gonna do is connect my keyboard to it so that it makes the typing a little easier. There. Okay. Now you need a USB-C OTG adapter and a USB formatted to FAT32. Go into storage and copy Dirty Cow FRP Bypass GAM6, GAM7, and Quick Shortcut Terminal Emulator to internal storage. And then install Quick Shortcut which isn't really needed, but it lets you access the pixel launcher so you can get to the home screen and not have to worry about getting spit back out in a setup. So now we can go into downloads, install terminal emulator, okay, so now CD home and then do cat SD card download dirty cow or uh, greater than dirty cow and do the same for gam6 dot apk GAM6 APK. Okay, and then do chmod777 all. And then run dirty cow system private app Google login service. Then Google login service dot APK. Space GAM 6.apk. There we go. Now go back out into your settings again. Go to apps. And, oops, oh shit. You should see Google Account Manager has disappeared even if we go into system. See, straight up gone. So, go back into downloads and install GAM 7.1, which now makes it a user app right here. But we're not done yet. We gotta open up terminal emulator again. This time, open up a new window. And run dirty cow again. This time, do data app com.google.android.gsf.login-1. Then it's base dot apk space gam oops base dot apk and then gam six dot apk oh oops 
make sure you're in your home directory first and then run that. Okay. Now open up another window. CD home. Go touch file. CHMOD 777 file. This time run dirty cow on data app com.google.android.gsf.login dash one forward slash oat forward slash arm 64 forward slash base dot odex space file now back out again open up your apps go to GSF login right here disable disable it'll ask you to uninstall and it'll tell you it failed yep you see it changes the app icon so now Go back to your storage, into your downloads, and install GAM 7.1. Okay. Now, go back to Terminal Emulator, and close out of everything. Settings, Apps, Uninstall, GSF Login again, and it's gone. Which now lets us go into Downloads, Install GAM6. Come on, dude. App is installed, which then lets us do FRP Bypass. And now it works. Browser sign in. Forgot I had the keyboard on it. Okay. Now that we've signed in. Make sure to install GAM 7.1. And now, reboot the phone. Turn off talkback. Then just go through the settings like you would normally. And there you go. Instead of telling me it's locked, there's my account on there.
and skip through the setup. And there you have it. This is Google Pixel 7 point run, 7.1, running the November 5th security patch. And OEM unlock, done. Right on. Enjoy.